Chris Patak with Card Concepts, and today we'll be going over the various steps on how to install a fast card or flex reader onto existing laundry equipment. This instructional guide will cover finding and drilling panel sections for the readers, installing universal brackets in both sections, connecting the necessary power and communication harnesses, and connecting and mounting the reader. Now before beginning, remember to have the machine completely off power. While the location of drilling and mounting readers to a machine may be at an installer or technician's preference, our recommended location for the stack combo washer and dryer specifically would be above the coin drops. We also recommend drilling into the panel while it is detached to prevent shavings or debris from going into the machine. First, remove the two hex bolts on the bottom row of the panel to pull the panel away from its housing. Once removed, immediately visible will be the air duct assembly and various wiring but behind the wiring are two punch tabs to allow CCI's harnesses to feed to the control boards and connecting ports. In this instance, one of the two punch tabs has already been removed for installation. Using the appropriate drill template, mark the drill locations on the panel, positioning appropriately to ensure that the readers are in an acceptable location to allow for visibility and prevent unnecessary cable tension or risk of internal component or wire damage. Although we will only be drilling through the center hole, the two screw holes on the sides would serve as a bracket reference point should further mounting reinforcement be necessary. After the drill locations are marked, remove the panel from the machine and set down on a drill-friendly surface. Using the recommended carbide-tipped hole cutter and cutting fluid, dab a sizable amount onto the surface area before cutting and drill a hole through the center. Note that using more cutting fluid is better for both lubrication and protection of both the drill bit and panel. For mounting both readers later, position the brackets and insert the chase nipples into the drilled holes. From behind the panel, thread and tighten the lock to secure. Minute adjustments may need to be made to level out the brackets and may require further tightening. This is just one bracket mounting example, as bracket mounting may depend on the hardware received from CCI through your distributor. Reader power, coin sense, and serial communication are achieved by connecting three harnesses, the C-6207 power harness into the 24 volt connector, the C-5300-NC coin sense harness to the 3-pin coin drop harness, and the C-5240 serial harness into the 7-pin connector on the detached serial communication board. For card-only solutions, the coin sense harness would not apply. Once the connections have been made for both boards in the stack washer-dryer combo, feed the other ends of the harnesses through the previously tab-punched hole. Retrieve the harnesses from the punched hole and feed through each individual mounting bracket hole ensuring the connections are divided and staged with their corresponding drilled holes. When the harness is fed out through the drilled centered hole, connect the coin sense, serial, and power harnesses to the back of the reader. As the system uses two readers, the coin sense harness would connect to the port closest to the 6-pin pulse port away from the corner edge for both readers. From there, seat the top edge of the fast carter flex reader to the top edge of the bracket and ease into place, ensuring the metal sides and bottom are carefully wedged inside the reader housing. Alternatively, for card-only solutions, you would only need to connect the serial and power harnesses to the reader. However, prior removal of the coin drop and coin vault would leave the below spaces open. Slide the CCI-provided coin vault cover into the coin vault slot until it locks into place and affix the coin vault cover label in place of the coin drop slot as shown. Regardless of the method of installation and mounting, remember to secure the reader with the provided mounting screws. And with that, we've reached the end of this guide. If this guide was informative, feel free to give it a like and subscribe to CCI's YouTube channel for more informative content. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the next video.